Hello, sports fan. This is Stephen Hale for Sports Choice Plus. I'm in your very special breakdown. I'm going to be covering the Minnesota Vikings taking on the New York Football Giants. Before I get right into that, I want to make sure you're subscribed to the YouTube channel so you can get all the updates and all the breakdowns. Without further ado, let's get right into it. Looking at this matchup here, the Minnesota Vikings have a lot on their plate. They're expected to be one of the best teams in the NFC North, and you're looking at them losing J.J. McCarthy to start the season, but they still have a backup. Sam Darnold is definitely a good backup, and you got to think he can still carry the torch. The only question is, will Justin Jefferson and company have enough from the quarterback position to be elite? Taking on a New York football Giants team where the defense is starting to look more and more better each and every week. You know they have Malik neighbors, but they still have Daniel Jones at quarterback. Daniel Jones has been a subject of a lot of jokes, a lot of talk, a lot of uh, goofy stuff on social media. So you got to ask yourself, will this start him to have a fire under him to where he's going to not only be an elite leader, but his play on the football field? Will his play be better than subpar? Would it be better than just average will this lead him to play better and, and live up to the contract that he has that essentially got saquon barkley let out the door so from the standpoint the giants have a lot of expectations not only for that defense but for the offense coach dable has to really ask himself you know can he win with this quarterback are they going to make trades are they going to make moves you never know what can happen throughout the nfl season but to start this one the Minnesota Vikings have the advantage offensively. I don't believe in Daniel Jones. I don't feel like he's going to have any type of X-factor feel. But from the standpoint of Justin Jefferson, you have one of the best wide receivers that can make any catch, any play. you got to think from the standpoint of having an upgraded one running back for the Vikings, having upgrades at the wide receiver position, they're in prime position to not only make charge and threaten the Green Bay Packers for the lead in this one, but they have a chance to make a statement. So the Giants defense is going to be their best hope of winning this football game, and it's going to be an X factor of who's better that day, the Vikings offense or the Giants defense, because I don't feel like Daniel Jones is going to be able to cancel out any quarterback play. I don't feel like the Giants running back is going to be able to do anything to show, okay, this is just... Uh, uh, bigger than what it needs to be. Jones is going to have his day running the football against the Giants, and I think that's going to lead to them having a big day offensively. Um, I think Justin Jefferson has a big day all over, and you're seeing why he's one of the highest paid wide receivers in the NFL. And I think that the Minnesota Vikings are going to carry this out with a big W. So all you Vikings fans, all you um, Giants fans, get in the comment section below. Definitely check out Sports Choice Plus. We'll see who wins, and we'll see you on the very next video.